Andrea Cominelli. Andrea Cominelli was an Italian stonemason, sculptor, and architect who was active in the Republic of Venice during the second half of the 17th century. Early years Little is known of Cominelli's youth. He was probably born in Venice in the first half of the 17th century into a family from Bergamo. In 1652, Francesco and Tommaso Morosini commissioned Cominelli to restore the facade of the Church of San Clement on the Isola di San Clement. He included busts of Morosini family members above the portal and their coat of arms. He also added statues of St. Benedict and St. Romuald and a Madonna and Cherub. The façade includes reliefs of scenes from battles commemorating the Morosini's victories in the war against the Turks. He is thought to have himself made the sculptures of the two brothers Morosini and of the two saints. Carmelite Convent Kalinali is recorded on a bill of payment dated 4 April 1653 for implementation of an altar in the church of the new Venetian convent of the Carmelites of St. Teresa. He was engaged in this work until the end of 1654. He supervised construction of the convent and church of San Paolo between 1682 and 1683, said by Brandolese in 1795 to have some elegance that would be greater if it were not encrusted with stucco. In 1679 he was in charge of the arrangement of the organ, with the work done by Eugenio Gasparini. On 7 April 1682, he signed an agreement for the partial reconstruction and beautification of the altar of the Blessed Virgin of Carmel. The church and convent of St. Teresa were built by Cominelli for the Sisters of St. Teresa and consecrated in 1688. The church has a tall, square, and simple design. Other work While working almost continuously for the Carmelites, Cominelli undertook other works. He made the altar of Baldassar Linghina's St. Mary the Virgin in 1674 minus 1677. He participated in the competition for design of the Dagana del Mar Customs House 1676 minus 1677. There are no records of activity after 1688. However, he was credited with the design of the Palazzo Labia, built for private clients. Cominelli designed the water facades of the building. The building was completed in 1696. Later the ballroom was decorated by the prospective artist Girolamo Mengazi Colonna and the fresco painter Giovanni Battista Taipalo. The paintings tell the story of Antony and Cleopatra. In the mid-18th century Alessandro Tremignan designed the Campo facade of the palace.